Hi everyone, James Bowles here with the Did You Know brought to you by the Center for Teaching and Learning. Today we are going to talk briefly about adding institutional learning outcomes to rubrics in Canvas assignments and quizzes and adding outcomes to existing rubrics. Let's start by navigating to outcomes on the left sidebar of your Canvas course. Click the Find button to add a new institutional learning outcome to the course. The four C's outcomes are located in Account Standards, Mesa Community College, MCC 4 C's Academic Year 15-16, then click on the particular C you would like to evaluate. Finally, click the Import button to add the outcome to your course. Repeat this procedure to add additional outcomes to the course. Now navigate to Assignments and click on the particular assignment to which you would like to add the outcomes. Click the pencil icon on the existing rubric to add the new outcomes. Click the Find Outcome link below the list of criteria to show all the outcomes that have been added to your course. Select the particular criterion you would like to add to the assignment. If you want to evaluate your students based on the selected criterion without having it affect the points available from the existing rubric, be sure to uncheck the box with the Use this criterion for scoring label. Then click Import. Repeat this procedure to add additional criterion to this assignment. Please note that each criterion can be added to any course once. Also, if you wish to separate criterion from the same outcome across multiple assignments, please name the assignments in such a way so that they can be easily identified as a series for later analysis. Just be sure to use all criteria in the outcome and not leave one out. Finally, click the Update Rubric button to save your changes. If you have not yet added a rubric to an assignment or a quiz, you can quickly add the institutional learning outcomes by clicking the plus rubric button. Then click the Find a Rubric link. Next, click on the Mesa Community College link, followed by the specific outcome you will be evaluating. Finally, scroll down and click Use this rubric. Note, if you add the institutional learning outcomes using this method, the outcome will automatically be added to the course outcomes and the criterion will not be used for scoring. I hope this Did You Know has been helpful and that we'll see you in the Center for Teaching and Learning soon.